Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to DLUK. Now, apologies for the last video, as I said before in the previous video, I don't know what happened with like the last remaining bit of the footage, I just seem to have lost it. Um, but you didn't miss out on too much, as I said before. So hopefully you can forgive me and we can just continue on. So today, um, in the story, I believe we were at the pirate ship. And yeah, so we should well just go on it and let's see what happens uh i have no idea what happens all right i think we've got this one in the bag yeah a fasty koopa not so fasty koopa saving pirates koopa huh the pirates did they just call us pirates well i'd say the pot knows a kettle when it sees it Koopo! Uh, we're outnumbered, Koopo! Now what, Koopo? Stop saying Koopo and fight, Koopo! Oops! Uh. Huh? <laughs> Banner. So, not as I was thinking of a boss, but more of a horde. And... And... We're not here to have fun, Koopo. Better. Mm, well, let's sort of understand who we're fighting against first. We can't imprison them. Damn it. I was hoping we could. So it's lightning and wind they're weak against. I don't believe I have those wins. Oh, I do have channel limit wind. There we go. That took one out. Man, those little hits are going to be annoying real quick. Blaze. I'm going to try Blaze. Let's try Blaze. Ah. <laughs> oh, that, that's, that's, that's really good. So we should really win in this next fight. Next attack, I should say. Blaze. <laughs> Oh, that's going to be so useful when taking out tipping hordes. You got us, Koopo! Scurvy swaps for shame! Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm guessing the battle's not over yet. Crap. Oh man, I thought this would be too easy. Awesome Mirage though. What are you, comedians? Too bad. If you've the brass to steal from pirates, then you know what comes next. So long, you clowns. clowns. Crap. Clowns? Why is it clowns? Whoa. I am so not going to be ready for this. I could just imagine me not being ready for this. Make yourself big. Well, oh, come on, I can't be asked. Um, we do have champions. Uh, the thing is, do I use them straight away? Uh, don't know who to what to use. Uh, we'll go with a double attack for now. That is messy. All I was gonna say the F word, but I chose not to. Uh, yeah, let's examine who we're fighting against with this. Ah, it's actually slightly weak to the fire. That will help. That will help. Oh, not. Holy crap. Ah. That's not even funny dangerous. There. 
Oh no. Oh no. We must have not been. We weren't supposed to win, were we? There's no way. We just weren't supposed to win this. Right? Seek with destiny. Fate has chosen us. The Thane of Seronia? Why is he here? <sighs> he followed us here? Wasted a mega flipping down Phoenix now down for this. And I wasn't supposed to win in the first place. Are we for oh bigger? my gosh. What could it be? Our cookies are merely meant to crumble. Nah. Giants from the hills. These questions are all yours and mine to answer. I'm guessing this is gonna be a more winnable battle. Mmm. I don't know who I'm fighting here. Federal General Guard. Federal Guard General. I can't read. <laughs> um. Who are you fighting? Eh, he didn't know what that. Yeah, this is definitely going to be easier. Uh. Double attack. Throw that to the mm, that didn't do as much damage as forward. Oh, come on, seriously. I guess I wasn't supposed to win that one either. So this is how the dice have rolled. Wow. Hey, clowns. Huh? Yes, ma'am. Perhaps you'd care to explain. Naturally, because she'd kick our ass if we didn't. So, the Federation replaced Thane Tucker with one of their soldiers. Actually, we're not too sure about that ourselves. But everything we've told you is true. Honest to the goodness! Well, believe me, I'd not put anything past those Federation dogs. But if they have monsters like that in power... Hey, um... Hmm? Captain Ferris, you wouldn't happen to know where they're headquartered. The Federation, I mean. Bahamut Citadel? No one knows a lick about that, lass. It was worth a shot. <laughs> Why? Was that your reason for trying to steal my ship? To go off on some wild goose chase? Uh, uh, the whole idea was launched! You don't say. What, me? Oh, I would never, ever, I mean, I don't even like ships. Not that there's anything wrong with your... Oh, please don't hurt me. <laughs> Billy there, lad. Okay. You see, I might be able to help you gents on your way after all. If you are the giants from the hills, the ones the prophecy mentions, then I recall the same prophecy mentioning where you're supposed to go. Huh? You mean there's more to it? Ahoy, Mog! You've read the prophecy, haven't you? I, I have, Kupo! The prophecy says quite clearly that the giants from the hills would collect four keys, open up a pathway to the crystal tower, brave its dangers, and mount the very heavens, Koopa! Four keys, huh? Wait, the crystal... tower? Hmm. So, Ma, 
I don't suppose you know where the four keys might be. I'm afraid I know of only the first one, Koopo. It's one more than I do. Koopo! The oh first gosh. key is set to lie in a... Oh, t'was the Valley of Fire, Koopo! Where's that? I can think of one place. The Fire Valley's in Babel. Down to the south of the Low Seas. <sighs> There's those Low Seas again. What labor, all these twists and little turns. But fate must be allowed to run its course. <laughs> uh, yeah, safe. Chapter, Chapter nine. 9, The Low Seas. The Low Seas. Mm. Okay, Taking, would so this like, be a good place to end it? I'm not too sure. The low seas and find that Valley of Fire. Well, I don't know. Are we really just going to follow some random prophecy word for word? But what other leads do we have? <sighs> Fine. I guess we'll run with it. Huh? What? Captain Ferris. Can you tell us how to get to the low seas? Hmm. Perhaps. But I'll not be lending you this ship. For one, she can't venture down sea, even if I were feeling generous. Ah. Oh, wait. Ahoy! Mog! Is our guest still aboard? Guest, Koopa? You know who? Oi, the lass in glasses. Oh, from the league, Koopa. She might be Koopo. I'll go look, Koopo. Oh my god, shut up! You need something? Quistus. Sorry to detain you. I thought we were done with our transaction. Did you find some sort of problem with the cargo? No, the goods were sound. I have another quandary, if you'll hear me out. What's that? These gents here have business in the low seas. Who are they? The giants from the hills. In the flesh. What? Ta-da! Cut that out! Oh. Sorry about Lon. I guess we might be the giants from the prophecy, but honestly, we don't know. Very intriguing. So... They need a boat. And as I recall, you've got one. Well, if it's true about the Thane, that he's some kind of monstrous Bahamutian doppelganger, then we don't owe him anything. Which means that the boat is up for grabs. Aye. Wait, up for grabs? What do you mean? Oh, uh, my group had some business to attend to in Seronia, so we presented the Thane with a boat. Some might call it a... A bribe. You don't need to wheel in the deal with a bunch of no good monsters like that. Yeah. You're not even listening. Yeah. So you're so absolutely certain. You saw that they'd undergo a transformation? Aye. And then Sildra let him have it. Okay. Well, don't get me wrong. I can see that they're giants. But I can also see they've got some growing up to do. Do you think they'll survive the trip? Huh. One splash in the low seas can't stop a prophecy. Well, I guess you win. You can take the fast craft down to the low seas. Oh, sweet! Thank you so much! Although, that whispering wasn't very encouraging. Okay, come see me when you're ready. I'll take you to the boat. Uh... Yeah, I think this is a bit better time than any really to end it here. Um... Yeah, so if you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Uh, I'm sorry this is short, but after the couple of vid last videos have been really long, I thought I'd keep this one short. So, yeah, I've been Dwayne and this has been World of Final Fantasy. Peace.